This episode of Law Math is brought to you by LawSkinShop.com, the best site for buying rare champion skins. In League of Legends, the Spell Thief's Edge is an item which grants ability power, mana regeneration, and bonus gold. On today's episode of Law Math, we'll be taking a look at how cost effective the Spell Thief's Edge and its upgrades can be. Let's take a look at the item now. The Spell Thief's Edge costs 365 gold and grants 10 ability power and 3 mana regeneration. It will also generate 2 gold every 10 seconds. It also has an effect which will grant 4 gold when auto attacking an enemy champion. This effect cannot trigger more than once every 10 seconds per target and will be disabled for 10 seconds on minion kills. The stats granted have a value of 397.5 gold at the basic level, meaning the Spell Thief's Edge is cost effective on purchase. The Spell Thief's Edge can be upgraded to the Frost Fang for 485 gold. It will grant 20 ability power and 7 mana regeneration along with generating 4 gold every 10 seconds. It will retain the gold on champion auto attacks from the Spell Thief's Edge but will now generate double the gold. The stats granted have a value of 855 gold at the basic level, meaning Meaning the Frost Fang is cost effective on purchase. The final upgrade of the Spell Thief's Edge is the Frost Queen's Claim, which costs 1,915 gold. It will grant 50 ability power, 10 mana regeneration, and generate 4 gold every 10 seconds. It will also retain the gold on champion auto attacks. When activated on an enemy champion, it will slow all nearby enemies by 30% for 2 seconds and deal 50 magic damage to them. This ability has a 60 second cooldown. Stats granted have a value of 1687.5 gold at the basic level, meaning one must have the Frost Queen's claim for 9 minutes and 29 seconds to be cost effective. This value will be reduced by 20 seconds each time gold is granted from champion auto attacks. Overall, the Spell Thief's Edge and Frost Fang are cost effective on purchase, while the Frost Queen's claim will take no more than 9 minutes and 29 seconds to become cost effective. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you'd like to be informed whenever I release new videos. Click the annotation on the screen if you'd like to see the previous Law Math episode. You can also like Law Math on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and watch me livestream on Twitch. Thanks for watching this episode of Law Math.